Hey guys, Vikas over here and you are watching We Are Genius. Guys, today I am again with a new video around the Amazon Echo Dot and the Son of TS10 module. And in this video, we will see how to interact or control any load that is connected to the Son of TS10 module from the Amazon Echo Dot by using the voice commands. And in this video, we will not get into like setting up the Son of TS10 module or the Amazon Echo Dot. For if you want to check those out, like how to do it, you can refer to my earlier videos for which I have given the links down below in the description. So in my earlier video around Son of TS10, I have shown like how to connect the load and all and setting up the mobile application for the Son of TS10. So make sure to check that out. And over here, we will not do any hardware connection because it is not required. We will just configure some applications from our smartphone and all. And you can control any load that is connected to the TS10 from the Echo Dot. So being said that, let's get started guys. Now to start it off, uh, let's first check if our sound of TS10 module is online. To do that, I'll get into the EWE link app and over here you can see my device that is named as LAMP is online and over here to uh, like show you, I've connected a simple LAMP or bulb over here and which can be turned and on and off from the EWE link app. So let's check out if this works. And again, if you are uh, like not aware of how to do it and all, configure the Son of TS10 and all, you can check my earlier video, as I said earlier. So, let's make it off first. Again, it is having some issue. Let's make it off. Now, get into the Amazon Alexa app. And over here, Okay, it is uh, already opened the skill pages. Otherwise, you can get into the navigation drawer over here and get into the skills. And search for EWE link. And you can see the EWE link smart home fan uh, skill is there. So just click on it. Click on enable. And it will like let to take you through a like account configuration and setting up page so i'll just check my region over here india provide your phone number that you have already given while configuring the ewe link app so just quickly go through it click login Now you'll see a message, you can now leave this page. So just close this page and click on discover devices on the Amazon Alexa app. I'll see a message, Alexa is discovering the devices and it may take up to 20 seconds as prompted. Now it has found one device that is called H lamp and this name is same as the name that i have given in the ewe link app so if you want to change it you can suddenly get into the device get into settings and you can change it i will not get into that uh, so let's minimize it Amazon alexa now from the alexa app itself i can control it i can see over here And the EWE link has also prompted that lab is on. Now let's quickly make it off. And let's try to control the lamp by using voice command. Alexa, make lamp on. Okay. And you can see it can make the lamp on using the voice command. So to make it off, you can use the command Alexa. Make lamp off. Okay. Let's try out some. Let's try out some other command. Alexa, switch on the lamp. Okay. Alexa, switch off the lamp. Okay. And you can see it is pretty much working. And over here, uh, as you know, the son of TS10 model has also got uh, like interface for interfacing humidity and temperature sensor. 
but by using alexa we can't get the temperature or metadata out of the tsn module so that's pretty much all about it guys this is a pretty short video around like how to configure the son of ts10 with amazon echo dot so i hope you have enjoyed this video if so hit the thumbs up button and if you have not subscribed yet consider subscribe it for videos like this so see you next time with my next video till then goodbye alexa what is the lamp temperature lamp doesn't support that Alexa, what is the temperature from Sonoff module? Currently, in a Delhi, Ethiopia, it's 15 degrees with mostly clear skies. Tonight, you can Alexa, stop.